All right, one last question for you. Um, what if you were to recommend some people, some of your favorite drummers of all time, like just like of any genre, people that you've always respected as a drummer? Um, one I've always loved, Jimmy Chamberlain from the Smashing Pumpkins. Like for some reason in high school, we used to always be like, <laughs> just like him, we love that shit. That's where I learned the. That's where I learned to love about drums. What What are some of your favorite drummers or even drum songs like in your life? Um. I like I like press drummer, press drummer. I, I, the the female drummer he had. Yeah, she was dope. And I like uh, what's his name with the pick? Oh, Questlove. I got to see him live and was like, okay, them that's shit different. Like he he does shit with drums, and then the guy from um, uh, what's his, what's what's the name of the group? Uh. Oh, it's an old school group. I see them in concert and said the fuck, fucking drummer is crazy. Um, oh God, what's their name? Uh, the guys. Do you remember? Oh, um, the September. That it's um, Earth, Wind and Fire. Earth, Wind and Fire. Yes, Earth, Wind, was, that's Earth, what it was. Wind and Fire, Fire. drummer. Yeah. They're amazing, man. I had to say, Man. I was listening to some Earth, Wind & Fire, my parents, like, oh, over holidays. I was looking through their records. I'm like, what do we got in here? We got some funk to it. And, like, I was like, I should be listening to these guys hey. all the fucking time. Them and Simon. I saw that, like, I I saw that dude playing drums, and I said, I need to learn how to play drums. Like, all the flipping the sticks, and he he was just going bozo. And then yeah. he had all the extra, you know, he had all the I was like, nah. I, I felt like it was a little bit too extra. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like all of the different things. But I was looking like, but no, he's playing them motherfuckers. He's playing them drums. He hitting all. Ch I'm like, yeah. oh, wow. Like, how do you even concentrate? Like, when I tried to do drums, I can't get the beat and all, I can't I, I can't get the rhythm. It's you know tough. what I'm saying? Yeah. But I, I can't do it. That's to why see I'm somebody insane. else do it and say, I don't know how he's doing it. I don't know how he's at the same time and not going off beat. And then when I, when I started learning music, I was like, the drummer runs the entire stage. Like yeah. if he's off, everybody's off. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So and and I watched um Sheila E. Yeah. I watched her tell another drummer in concert, you're not in the pocket. Get in the pocket. Get in the pocket. We was so like, I'm Sheila like, e on stage. Yeah, I'm looking like what what whatever he's doing wrong, whatever you doing. Oh, bro, get in the fucking yeah, pocket. Yeah, fix it fast. Now, she, she was tapping the stick, saying, get in the pocket. Get in the pocket. I'm in the car and say, whatever the fuck is he doing? Get your ass in the pocket. And yeah. and I was like, so when I when I, when I I went to the studio, I was like, hey, some, if a drummer telling another drummer to get in the pocket, what what they mean by that? He's like, oh, he had a rhythm. He got to get in the pocket. Yeah. He's throwing the rhythm off. I'm like, yeah, like oh. If Sheila E is ever yelling that at yeah. me, what do I do? <laughs> yeah, Sheila E. Sheila E is a drummer. Sheila E is a drummer. Fascinating. Sheila E is a drummer. The girl that Prince had, whew, she's a drummer. Quest Love is a drummer. Yeah. And that boy from uh, Earth, Wind, and Fire is, whoo, Lord, have mercy. Yeah. I like, I like, uh, the, what's that name? Chili Peppers? Is that name real? Oh, Chili yeah. Peppers? Chad Smith, the guy that looks like Will Ferrell. Um, I like all, I like they whole crew, though. Yeah. yeah Even yeah. they guitarists, like, I, I, I like them. Yeah, I met one of them, and where were we at? L.A. Mm -hmm. L.A. I met him in L.A. I don't know what his name is. He the one with the glasses. Oh, uh, maybe John Frusciante or Flea or Anthony Kiedis or he 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 got the podcast with uh with the guy with the beard. Oh, Rick Rubin. He's got the podcast with Rick Rubin. Oh fuck! So I don't know which one it is that I didn't know they had a podcast yeah, together. Yeah. But I got to find out about yeah, that. Yeah, they got a podcast Rubin. together. Yeah, they yeah. I ended up when we get to when we got to LA and I met him. Um, somebody gave me that clip of him saying that Ghetto House was one of his favorite new sounds of music. I was like, "What?" You know what I'm saying? Rick I Rubin? still actually ain't even got. It, it, he was telling Rick Rubin that. Uh, Rick Rubin asked him like, "Is it any new sounds you like?" It sounds like it's up Rick Rubin's aisle because I mean he was like he was right up there being the, the, the eight oh eight. It was like him on like yeah, LL Cool yeah, J and that, Run DMC and Beastie Boy songs. Yeah, that Rick Rubin. And, and when I saw him and Rick Rubin talking about Ghetto House, I was like, "Oh shit!" 
Yeah. You know, real. like, that's crazy. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that was crazy to me. I was looking like, well, it ain't, you know, I'm one of those people, like, if it ain't, if it ain't broke, I ain't trying to fix it. So I'm not, you know, I know some people be looking like, man, it's been around for a while. You know, why haven't you went to something else now, nah, bro? I mm -hmm. love what I do. I love this sound. Like, I love this sound. I'm going to live and die with the sound. I'm, mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's either going to work or it ain't going to work, but I'm going to keep doing it until somebody tell me it don't work no more. Yeah. You know what I mean? So. I think it's going to keep working. So. Yes, sir. Appreciate cool, man. You. All right. Well, I appreciate this interview. It's such a pleasure to talk to you. Uh, your man, voice pleasure is fascinating. Man. Yeah. And, uh, we talked about tons of music. Check it out. We'll have your information below the entire time. So, okay. uh, cool, man.